excuse me if I've ever been like, oh, I don't watch it, I don't like think it's good or whatever. I would like to retract everything I've said in the past about Glee. When he changes that, I'm like, And again, if I ever talk bad about Glee or I'm not really into it, I could get, I take it back. I take it all back. I have boiling water to gelatin mix. Hola, hola, good morning, my friends. It has begun. It is happening. We are literally in the middle of callback week. We are three days away. Refraining from screaming, screlting, or doing any high-pitched voices as we know that that will damage the vocal cords. So I've been very conscious of what's been leaving my throat. I am making some jello right now and other little stuff that's going to help me for the week. Um, I'm boiling the water right now. I was just reading the directions because I have not made jello in like forever, forever. This callback has been occupying so much of my mind and we are just like at the last couple of days. I think it actually, okay, it is boiling. It's ready. I need to move this along. Turn this down. Ooh, 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 ooh. Are we already getting into it? Before I continue, hi, my name is Paloma. Welcome if you are new to my channel. It is some pretty easy steps. Ooh, that smells so good. I love that. Where are the directions? I know it's not that hard, but okay. add boiling water to gelatin. Stir for two minutes until completely dissolved and then stir in cold water. Okay. I don't have any like other molds. I'm using that for my lemon and chia seed concoction, but I should have maybe gotten a bigger Tupperware, perhaps. Um, the gelatin in jello is so good for coating your throat and anytime I'm looking for just like a little snack in between the day I could just open this little container up and have a little piece of jello so I'll be snacking and helping my voice oh boy she is right to the brim ooh, 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 ooh. noted next time I'll be using a larger container but I do stand by the thought process I feel like this is gonna be easier to just store oh now all I gotta do is put it in the refrigerator ooh. I'm also going to be prepping these lemon chia bombs. Oops. I like making... Please. We have guests. Okay. I usually like making these little ice cubes for my stomach because the chia seed is very good for all that. But lemon and hot water and honey is also very good for the voice. So I'm thinking we'll make some for the week as well. Tomorrow morning I will show you how they come out and I just pop them in and it's so easy. I love lemons. Love, love, love them. I think I use like two lemons a day. <laughs> One tablespoon of chia seeds. Split halfway with lemon and then the other half with water. Oh, me oh my, this needs two hands. Oh my God, but once I get to the freezer, how am I gonna, it'll be fine. Okay. Having a vocal lesson in between my lunch today for 30 minutes. I'll be having a warm tea right now, but at that time I will have room temperature water. Please remember, singers, when you are singing or right about to sing, room temperature water. All right, you guys, I'm heading to my desk and I will check in with you guys at lunch. Okay, so there has been a change of plans. We have made it to lunch. I am finishing up my lunch. I'm doing like a little protein shake, some fruit. Great for your voice because it has a lot of water in it so it keeps you hydrated and it's healthy. So things like grapes, blueberries, watermelon, all that good fruit. Also, if you are a 20 whatever listener and you listened to that episode about a day in our lives and I talked about how I like didn't start eating until like the afternoon. My gosh, my producer Jess recommended that I start doing like protein in the morning. I'm like, I know she knows what she's talking about, but man, she knows what she's talking about. This little protein in the morning has really helped like support my stomach and get it going. And it has like, I, I like can't even explain how great this has been. It's really good. I usually don't like how things taste that have protein in them. I don't know why they taste so bad. You're like, this is a protein bar. Why does it taste like chalk? I just like don't really like protein things, so I was just like very hesitant, but this guy got it from Costco this last time I went and I got it like in big bulk and I love these. I'm having one every single morning and it honestly started to substitute my coffee in the morning. It's like caffeine flavor and it does have caffeine in it, so I'm like, what's the need for spiking my cortisol levels and getting me all crazy? I do that all on my own. So, um, update, I am no longer having a vocal lesson 
except for we can't be sad because my vocal coach, who also is an actor and like working in this business, just booked something and she's gonna be flying to Miami to record something. Great news and I'm very, oh, sending her all the love. Absolutely amazing, honestly. We know how hard it is to book, so the fact that she is booked and recording and on set, like go, go. We'll be back here and we can reschedule. But I do need to still take this time and practice my singing. I did a lot this 30 minutes for the vocal lesson, so I think I'm going to just study all the materials that casting sent us to prepare for callbacks. They did send us some tracks. I hop into the tracks. We have got to warm up. Maybe mash my M and M's. Oh no, mash my M and M's. Digital age, my guys. You can just go onto YouTube and type in vocal warm up. Ooh. Mm -hmm. This is also why it's super important to have a vocal coach. Is your coach can be there to really assist you so you don't hurt or like damage your voice because then they can ensure that you are practicing properly because there's just so much more than just opening your mouth, obviously, right? It's singing from the correct place, not straining your voice. And so right now I'm practicing and really not trying to strain. Please note, big yawn. Bitch, that is your chest voice. I. <laughs> Play a little bit of this track so you can see what I'm working with. Different parts to sing, which there's like bass, alto, soprano, and I'm gonna be playing the soprano. And they sent a clip of where they like are emphasizing on that note. So this is not the melody, this is not how the song goes, this is like the notes that I need to learn. And listen to how it sounds. This song's so corny. If they did ask me to sing that, it would not be to that track, it would be like to the actual thing, and I need to like actually just like know the notes and sing along with everybody and harmonize, which is tough for me, so let's practice. In the heights, in the heights, oh, in Washington Heights. There's also a song in there that I have a solo, so I'm like, should I be learning this song too because they could have me sing it? I like don't know. Obviously now preparing things that they didn't tell me to prepare, but it's because in the past, obviously there's been times that they didn't tell me everything to prepare. So what if they say, bring in the Ninas, let's have them learn the harmonies so we can all... That has happened to me before. They didn't put it in my envelope, so I didn't learn it. It's over and I have got to get back to work. I'm going to try to chug another one of these. I feel like I've been consuming so much water, but I still know I'm not consuming enough. Good morning, guys. I am checking in on our chia and lemon seed balms. Hold on. Let's see how they're looking. Ooh, okay. Okay, they are looking good and ready for the tea. I'm not sure why this, the left side, looks like it has so much more chia seeds than the other, but they have equal amounts. You guys are all strapped in there. It is day two, well, two days until callbacks. Two days away from callbacks. I'm gonna be leaving in a couple minutes to head out for my lash appointment. I'm so excited about this. Oh, wait a second. This looks so drippy. Being extra cute in their star shaped mold, but look at I don't know if you can see that. It's kind of making me feel weird like seeing all these like little little chia seeds in there. Ew, okay. Hot water. I have some chia seeds, lemon, and hot water for the stomach. Growing up, I used to always watch my mom have her warm water with lemon every single morning. I will say it's interesting to see myself here having my hot warm water with lemon. I'm leveling up by adding some chia seeds, but I'm like, boy, do you look like your mother right now. This is the mug I petitioned to keep in the cupboard year round. Ryan was putting like all the Halloween decorations and like the mugs away, and I was like, what if we kept this one just like for always? And he was like, but it's Halloween theme. And I'm just like looking at him like, please, this makes me happy. All right, Paloma, we can keep this Halloween mug in the cupboard. And I was like, success. 
I'm gonna eat this garlic clove because everyone and their mother is sick in LA and since I have to go out, I'm just like, I need to have my immune system so up because every time I've left my house lately, I've gotten sick. So I'm just petrified and doing everything in my ability to stay safe and healthy. So when it is emergency time, you have to eat the garlic cloves. Let me get my honey for extra chaser. Cheers. Don't smell it. I don't know if I'm gonna try to smell it. so spicy. I have not done that in a while and ooh, that was really wow. Don't scream. All right. I've got to brush my teeth because my poor lash lady will be like, ma'am, Lyft will be here in 10 minutes. But I can still taste the garlic. Mmm. And it's me doing it right before I'm gonna have a lovely lady right in front of my face doing my lashes for hours. I don't think I really thought that through. <laughs> it tastes so bad. I can still taste the garlic in my mouth. I have to do round two. Oh my gosh. A little bit of this for good measure. Love my lash girl Luna. She does such a great job every time. So sweet and silly. She always has the best tea and the best stories. So. Can't wait to catch up with her and have her make me look beautiful. Oh, Lyft is here. Just got home, darlings. Okay, first and foremost, look at the lashes. They look so gorgeous. Um, I wanted to show you this because I was just so I was I was embarrassed a little bit. Um, my lash lady is so sweet and said, I got you this for Christmas for my favorite client. And she wasn't able to give it to me over December because I tried to do DIY at home lashes for the month of December to like save money. Oh my gosh, no, please stop. <gasps> I never went to go see her. She's gonna be like, I haven't seen you in a while. Where have you been? And I'm gonna be like, trying to save my money, girl. Collagen cleansing foam mask and she Pretty sure Dr. Pepper was a dentist. I got scaling. It'll be as good as me. All right, open up. Close. Close again. Just remember yeah. the one that spaceship right. Yeah. Well, I'm just trying to find out why would I know? I came to work. I was a Good morning, very quickly. Today is a very big day. I've got to get on vocal rest as soon as today is done. Tomorrow is callbacks. Today also is a big day because me and the girls from 20 Whatever are going to the Dear Media Studios for the very first time. A quick little fit check before the studios. This is what I'm thinking. Cute, cute. Some knee high boots. And of course, the new pink purse. Like, <laughs> So excited to see the studios and like the team and just like be there with the girls. Like, I can't wait. All right, wish us luck. I was just about to sit down and tell you, hi, I'm back. And I just sat on my folder. Here, is this better lighting? Hold on, let's see. Here they are, you guys. Take a look. After we got done with lunch, um, I stopped by Walgreens because I had to print off some headshots and resumes. If you're an actor, you know that life. You gotta go get some hard copy stuff. And I don't have like a printer that can print off pretty pictures like this. And I have not placed like my large order of now that I have my new headshots. But like print this off with a border and my name on it. And that's what I usually get. But when you don't have those, you gotta go to Walgreens or Staples. All that's left is to shower, get my hair ready, so for how I wanna do it tomorrow, get it all clean. I think I'm going to get cozy, watch the musical, go on vocal rest, and just be so strong here, strong here, because once you get thrown in to callbacks, 
you get spit out, okay? It's like very Hunger Games. I feel just so ready and I'm just so excited to get out there and like sing. Like I feel really confident and prepared. So all that's left is to rest the voice, Paloma. Good morning, you guys. How are we doing? Let's talk about you. Let's not talk about me because if you ask me how I'm doing, I don't think I can properly answer the question. What time is it now? It's 8.30. I set my alarm for 7.30 just so my voice could start waking up and I've just been laying here like really trying to ground myself, get excited about what's to come and enjoy being surrounded by so many talented people. Ryan just recently got back from a work trip and he had like a sore throat and so we were like really worried of like obviously running the risk of him giving it to me like the day before callbacks. So last night we were like both wearing masks in the house and like slept separate beds. He's in the guest room so I'm just trying to keep my voice down still not whispering because singers i don't know if you know but i learned that whispering is also very damaging to the vocal cords who'd have thought you would think that just yelling is bad for your voice because you're like ow but also whispering is bad for your voice so i'm trying not to whisper right now but keeping my voice down ryan just texted me call back day I made it. I am doing final warm-ups in the car. It, I had to literally rush uh, quicker and leave my house sooner than I thought because there was an accident, of course. Hashtag just LA thing. So I literally had to just quickly get on my makeup and my hair. So I left very early and it took me about an hour to get here, which was a bit of a bummer. Um, but um, we're here. I'm in the parking lot. There's lots of people going in. Gonna go do check-in. And then here we go. Wish me freaking luck, you guys. <laughs> Callbacks are a rush. Cup is full, heart is full. I feel so empowered. Before we began auditions, the casting had us come into the room and they sat us all down. Let us know about their company and about incredible turnout they had. They said that they had over 700 people come out to audition for this project. And in that room was probably 50 people they were just emphasizing wow to be here right now is already such a success and when i got to sing for my role there were only seven other girls in the room for it in the room including myself there was only eight of us i like took that in and was just like an accomplishment i feel so empowered like i feel so great like this is such a win already and like i already knew that because the opportunity to get to sing for anyone and the opportunity to sing for people that like enjoy this show and people that cast show like in the heights are just like really care about the show they're passionate about the show and so and the team oh my god today very was so passionate about the show i believe that the director said she has done this show like six times so like you have got to love something and just like feel it so deeply in your heart that you want to just like keep doing it and just not, like we can't get into that right now i did a lot of waiting just waiting around until they were calling our name as an actor, there's a lot of waiting involved in the job. And so we were just hanging out. I was introducing myself to some of the other girls there and just making conversation. And everyone was so nice, like genuinely so nice. And I called for my role. We all went in. The pianist played for us one time. We played it with the track one time. The pianist could see and they all watched us. And they just called us one by one and we sang it and did it. And I left my heart there, right there in front of them and just really, felt it and really tried to give them like a performance and i remember the casting director said i just want to be blown away and so i was like all right like let's give it to them so i just like checked in with myself and said i was ready and then i began the song and it went really good and i'm really excited about it there were so many talented girls so truly any person that gets it will be so successful and will make this show such a success I truly feel honored being one of those actors in that room you know, it was just a great experience and they said they'll let us know early next week. So fingers crossed for what's meant to be. And this was just, I feel so happy. It, fe it felt really great to get to perform for those people. And I know that they really enjoyed it. So thank you guys so much for watching this and watching me prep for this. Please make sure you're subscribed so you can see what happens next. I will see you guys next time. Bye.